Well, if you're someone like me who's got a portable palate and you want to go and taste everything the world has to offer, each different port that you go to not only has a wealth of restaurants on the doorstep, there's also just beyond it a wealth of tours you can go on. We're standing in one of the great wineries of Spain. We left the ship at Valencia to come here, taste the wines, enjoy a phenomenal lunch, benefit from a little bit of expertise to enhance that extra bit of enjoyment. Back on board, fresh in time for dinner. I love cruising. Passengers have had a wonderful day. They had the most incredible welcome straight into the heart of the winery, seeing all of the fermentation tanks, all of the kind of backstage area where wine really happens. In a place like this, it's somewhere where science comes together with artistry. But the other thing I'd just like to say about wineries is uh, I just think they would make the ultimate place for the location of a James Bond finale. <laughs> From there, straight down to the barrel hall, it's wonderful to see the impact of ageing on wine and what each individual barrel does to enhance the flavour in the bottle. French oak tends to be a bit more subtle, taste of vanilla. Uh, American oak tends to taste of coconut. From there, we've come straight over to the old winery via the vineyards for a little personal tour of the local Bobal grapes. Who's ever had a glass of Bobal? They have now. What you're really looking for in top quality bottle fermented sparkling wine is lots and lots of tiny delicate bubbles. Now, just behind me, all the passengers are enjoying the most sumptuous lunch ever paired with the most glorious wines. Unbelievable enjoyment and I'm so pleased that passengers get to see the real side of Spanish winemaking in action. I think the trip's been, uh, been great, it's been a, a real experience to, to come on a wine tour with Ollie. He's a real character who makes the day really. Yeah, we really enjoy wine and maybe try wines now that we've not tried before. Oh, it's been a great day, we've had a really fantastic day. Ollie has been a superb host. We've tasted a Spanish wine we didn't even know existed. Any holiday, of course, the food and the drink you enjoy is going to be right at the centre of your experience. That's what's so special about cruising. You know, it's not just a shore where you can taste all of these fantastic things on board. The food and drink is at the heart of the experience. I'm so proud to be delivering 32 wines by the glass in the glass house, a real exploration of the world of flavour. We host wine tastings in the glass house and I can tailor them to specific requirements, take them on different journeys. Um, we also have hosted dinners by me, so I'll pair wines to the food that we've delivered, especially for the people that night. I call it my little secret supper club. It might end up slightly raucous, but think of it this way. The more you taste wine, the better you get. Wonderful to be on board a ship with all of the luxurious facilities in the world, great flavour on the plate. You hop off and you visit some of the world's greatest sites ashore, La Boqueria in Barcelona. It's world famous for flavour, but it just brings you in with your eye. The rainbow of colours, think of all that fabulous fruit and veg, the world's greatest ham on, of course, and that fantastic fish market. Oh, I'm there right now. You might find yourself in Italy the next week or France the week after that. It's utterly enchanting. It's the first cruise we've done and each day you're waking up in a different part and uh, we've loved it, something we're going to do again. And during the cruise the food's been really good and I think the trip today has just um, been the icing on the cake really. One of the loveliest things about my job is to meet the people who come on holiday with P&O Cruises and to express how much I love wine and share my passion with them. Uh, people on holiday are always so receptive to tasting something new. I'm amazed at how intrigued people are to sit down, take in the view, watch the sea go by or a fantastic port and enjoy a glass of the world's greatest. Mm -hmm.